As the conflict between Qatar Airways and Airbus reaches new heights, the Middle Eastern carrier has released video footage showing some of the damage that its Airbus A350 fleet has experienced. Thus far, only a handful of out-of-context photos had been revealed, but the new video recently released shows the impact in context on the aircraft. Later this year, Qatar Airways is expected to face off against Airbus in the London courts over an ongoing dispute over damage to some of its Airbus A350 aircraft. Last week, as the conflict intensified, Airbus revealed that it had taken the drastic action of cancelling a larger order placed by Qatar Airways for narrowbody jets. Qatar Airways' video reveals that the damage experienced on its Airbus A350 planes isn't superficial. As you can see, the video shows several different types of damage, including exposure of the aircraft's lightning protection system and some composite structures to the elements. The airline welcomed a decision by the Technology and Construction Division of the High Court in England to expedite the court case to April 2022. The video was released one day after Airbus cancelled a separate order for 50 Airbus A321s placed by the airline. Qatar Airways highlighted this, suggesting that the reveal of the extent of the damage might have been released in retaliation. Up until now, the damage had remained out of the public eye. Commenting on the release, the airline said, We confirm that we are adhering to all our obligations under all applicable contracts. It is therefore a matter of considerable regret and frustration that Airbus has taken the apparent decision to expand and escalate this dispute. 21 of Qatar Airways' Airbus A350 jets have now been grounded due to such issues detected on the aircraft. Earlier this month, it was revealed that the airline was seeking $600 million in damages from Airbus through the proceedings. In addition, the airline wants an extra $4 million for each day a plane remains grounded. This would add up to the 2018 list price of an A350-900 every 80 days. In late November, it was revealed that other aircraft operators had also been experiencing issues with paint on the Airbus A350 fleet though none had taken steps as drastic as Qatar Airways. Lufthansa noticeably sent its three oldest A350s for repainting under warranty. The problem was first detected when a Qatar Airways A350 was due to be repainted around a year ago. What do you make of the damage shown on the Qatar Airways Airbus A350s? If you were in support of Airbus previously, does seeing the severity of the damage change your mind at all? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles and a podcast every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe before you go.